Well, this morning we are following breaking news out of Ukraine. Still ahead on Today in the Bay, a report from Moscow of, as after Putin launches a deadly missile attack at the capital. A look at the damage now left behind as the country's war with Russia rages on. Hi, Chris Sanchez, and I want to show you one of the places most special to my family, Happy Hollow Park and Zoo in San Jose. What I love about this place is that it reminds us that the simple pleasures really make the best memories. We came here so many times, I can't even tell you, but every time we came, it was a different adventure. And even now that they're teenagers, I'm hoping that as they look forward, they'll remember to come back here where we made some of our happiest memories. It's places like this that remind me why my family calls the Bay Area home. It's Friends and Fun with Kelly at 3. And the Bay Area's only national news at 4. Then join me for local news that moves the Bay Area forward. Watch Kelly at 3. NBC Nightly News at 4. And NBC Bay Area News at 4.30. Weekdays. Join NBC Bay Area and Telemundo 48 at the Peninsula College Fund's mm. annual lunch on October 20th. You can make a difference for first-generation scholars by registering today. For more information, visit NBCBayArea.com. Breaking right now at 5, Russia retaliates. Cities across Ukraine are now under heavy attack from Russian missile strikes. The aftermath and the growing death toll this morning. Also the new response from Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky. And expanding availability. We're moving you forward with more on the vaccine clinic set to reopen today. Plus... This is supposed to be the big bang, you know? The big final bang. And it just kind of went out with a little, you know, whimper, you know, a little whimper, whimper. <laughs> Take off, suspended. The big finale for Fleet Week comes to a disappointing end thanks to Carl the Fog. The negative impact that could have had on tourism. This is Today in the Bay. We're streaming on Roku, Amazon, Fire, Apple, and online. No fog will stop us. Yay! Hope you had a great weekend. Good morning. Thanks for joining us. I'm Laura Garcia. And I'm Chris Sanchez. Marcus Washington is off. We're going to get to that great news in just a moment. But we want to start with a look at the forecast. Meteorologist Carrie Hall is tracking what we can expect. Boy, that fog stole the show. I uh, know. And it's kind of stealing the show this morning, too. <laughs> We're seeing it kind of rolling around parts of the North Bay, especially, as well as the South.